Hi, I am Andreas, and in this Nexperia video series, we will explain everything about ESD protection. Which capacitance of the ESD protection device is the best for your design? In one of our previous videos, we learned that during normal data transmission, the ESD protection can be represented as a capacitance. A capacitance itself is adding a small portion of capacitive load to the system, which is impacting the data transmission slightly. The higher the capacitance, the higher the impact on the data transmission. However, the real impact is also strongly dependent on the frequency and hence the data rate. The bigger the data rate, the smaller the device capacitance of the SD protection device should be. For example, in LIN interfaces with data rates of 20 kilobit per second, a device capacitance of up to 100 picofarad is allowed. In automotive Ethernet applications, you should have no more than 3 picofarad. And in infotainment and status applications, you should choose an ESD device with less than 1 picofarad. Hit the like button and subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you would like to learn more, write your questions in the comments below, visit nexperia.com and check out our ESD application handbook. Thanks for watching.